once we got off, we needed to go to Hogsmeade and to the potion shop. Ooh. Something smells in here. We have everything a young student might need when it comes to potions. Have a good look around. Okay, so I need one of those. A wise decision. Thank you. Hope to see you again. Is there a way to open recipes? You? What a pleasant surprise. You okay, cool. Now, you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. <laughs> no one can say I don't keep a stacked <laughs> shelf. Oh. Revelio.
What are you up to now? Okay. <clears throat> Yes. Can we go? Cast the fiends. Let's see. Revelio. Rebellion. That's the last time I have a pitch an idea that Rebellio. Have you finished your assignments? I finished the tasks, Professor. Well, well. 
I trust you are meticulous in your efforts. After all, shortcuts only ever lead to shortcomings. <clears throat> yes, sir, of course. Good. Ordinarily, I'd say it's not my concern either way, but you... I want to make sure you're well prepared. Talent and resolve are a potent combination. It would be a shame to let that go to waste. Thank you, Professor. Don't let it go to your head. <clears throat> now, let's see how you fare with Defindo. Wand at the ready. Focus. Defindo can be dangerous if you're not paying attention. Very good. It seems. And that of everyone else. Akio! Defender! It's a pleasure to have a student who actually heeds instruction. Let me go. Akio! As I mentioned earlier, Defindo can be versatile but dangerous. Good to see you continuing to practice. Akio! Let me also! Defindo! Confringo! <clears throat> Professor Sharp, do you have a moment? Depends on how you intend to use it. I saw an aura badge on your desk and was wondering if you could tell me more about your time as an aura. Mm, observant. I suppose I could indulge you for a moment. Spent years tracking down reprobates who dealt in artifacts of dark magic origin. That sounds positively exhilarating. Exhilarating? Hmm, it was at that. While well, it lasted, at any rate, I enjoyed a great deal of success as an aura. However, success can make one complacent if one's confidence is not tempered by humility. One overstep in battle changed everything. May I ask what happened? Yes, well, I suppose it's a matter of record. My partner and I had tracked a suspect to a harbor in Scarborough, trying to smuggle shrunken heads of all things. I had deduced that he was working alone. I was mistaken, and they knew we were coming. From the moment we stepped onto the ship, well, I barely escaped with my life. My partner wasn't so lucky. Uh, I, I suppose being an aura is dreadfully dangerous. I'm sorry. <sighs> it is that. But survival is not guaranteed for any of us. Pay attention. And not just within my class. This is what I must impress upon you all. A potion and a poison may be a mere breath apart until you consume the wrong one. Well said, <clears throat> Professor. Akio! Defendo! Confringo! Nice to see you, There's my young friend. Else. Revelio.
It's not on your nose. I don't know you'd want to know. I was hoping to see you. Revelio. You're back. Finally. Minister Spavin talks more than he listens, ranted on and on about rogue dragons. Wouldn't listen to a word about goblins. Speaking of which... Listen, Professor. So much happened while you were away. Your friend, Mr. Ollivander, sent me an owl asking for help finding an heirloom wand that was stolen from him. He did, did he? And so I went to the owlery, like he said, and there were all these statues. What do you mean, statues? In the owlery? Yes, which led me to a secret hideout where I found Richard Jackdaw's ghost. Who on earth is Richard Jackdaw? He was a student here long ago. Anyway, he told me about a secret cavern. I went there, and right next to Jackdaw's skeleton, I found the missing pages. You found the pages? I did. And because Jackdaw had followed the map they contained, when I found the pages, I found the location on the map. Believe it or not, it's a room below Hogwarts. Why am I not surprised? Shall we? I was hoping you'd say that. Oh, and we'll need to bring the book. need to bring the book. The room is called the map chamber, by the way. And the portrait of Percival Rackham awaits us there. Professor Rackham. I look forward to meeting him. How did this Jackdaw get the pages from the book? Evidently, Peeves stole them, and Jackdaw stole them from him. Oh, Peeves. more enjoyable with a friend.
looks promising. to see this. <laughs> Hello, Professor Rackham. We've placed the book on the pedestal as you asked. And this is my mentor, Professor Fig. <clears throat> How do you do, Professor Fig? And you, my young friend. See now why you needed to return with the book? I do. I also see why you refer to this room as the map chamber. That you have come this far tells me that you possess extraordinary magical ability, the potential and power of which will unlock should you prove yourself worthy. The location of each of four trials will, in time, appear on the map. Trials that will test you and give you access to invaluable knowledge. Trials that you must complete on your own. Do you recall the pensive memory you viewed in my vault in Gringotts? You and your friend Charles spoke of the port key and of trials you'd created for one who could see traces of ancient magic. Precisely. Charles is another of the keepers, a designation we gave ourselves centuries ago in light of the knowledge that we have been bound to keep hidden. Until perhaps now. So. The passage from your ruins to Gringotts, everything in the vault, the restricted section, finding this room, none of these was a trial. They were an important part of the journey, but they were not trials themselves. The fact that you have come this far, however, bodes well. The trials were designed to ensure that the power and knowledge we have kept secret for so long does not fall into the wrong hands. They will test your abilities, both innate and learned. But of equal importance, everything you witness as you complete the trials will inform what you choose to do with all that we share. You will need patience. The trials have much to teach you. It will take time. I'm afraid we don't have the luxury of time. We have waited this long, Professor Fig. Surely a few more. Respectfully, sir, while I do not know the secret you keep, I do know that our young friend here has seen traces. Traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. And we encountered an uncommonly powerful goblin wielding such magic as we prepared to leave your vault at Gringotts. We may already be too late. This is grave news indeed. Young friend, do you trust Professor Fig? I do. Then, in the light of your considerable skill and all you have already accomplished, we shall begin. You will find the location of the first trial marked on the map below you. Whilst Professor Fig may assist you in locating the trials, they may be completed only by one with our ability. <clears throat> shall we have a look? I know that tower. It's not far. You may have seen it yourself. It looks familiar. <laughs> Perhaps your young friend is more well-traveled than you might think. As your mentor, the least I can do is go ahead to make sure it is safe. Join me as soon as you can. I'll find you at the tower as soon as I can. Until then, be careful 
and do not tell anyone where you're going. Iglesias, the freezing spell. It is an efficient way to cool down a heated situation. But first, I will need you to complete a few tasks. Once you've done that, come and see me. Probably like right here. Yep, I was <clears throat> close. Brilliant. Rebellion.
What are you doing out here? Challenging you to a game of Summoner's Court. I Summoner's Court isn't just a game. I'm in. Let's do it. Brilliant. <clears throat> Summoner's Court, the ever-changing game. Akio. Try to beat that. Okay. Akio. <clears throat> that was one for the ages. Akio. Nothing to it. How do you do that? Akio. I mean, is it gonna make me go? Come on, Neander. Oh. Let me go. Akio. Not bad. Not, Not bad. bad. Well done. You beat me. Ooh, I got a hundred. Perfect. <clears throat> Bit of good luck. That... Come now, Leander. Fine, you're good. I'll let the others know you're good enough. The others? The others who play Summoner's Court thought that if you couldn't beat me, you wouldn't be... Chin up, Leander. Keep practicing and you'll get better. I suppose you're right. I'll let the others know that your metal's been tested. those tasks. Rebellion. Madam Kagawa, I completed the list. Wonderful. I trust you be... Yes, Professor. That's good to hear. Keep it up, and perhaps what If Black ever permits Quidditch again. Well, with those tasks out of the way... Okay. Pay attention to your wand work. Oh, my. Well done. I'd recommend that you practice your new spell here. Before taking it. There you go. Catching them quickly. Akio. I think it's learned its lesson. But do continue to practice as long as you like. Kinesthesia is a powerful learning tool.
I'd like to ask you about changing... Of course! I'd like the room to be warm and calm. Oh, sounds perfect. Let's want to see. I wonder what the others look like. I mean, that doesn't look bad because it does look the light come through so you can see. <clears throat> I'd like to ask you about... Of course! I'd like the room... Oh, sounds bad. Let's see. How does this change? I kind of like that one, actually. Yeah. Definitely. That's definitely better. Oh, we can still... Do see what you're doing. <clears throat> On the map of stuff to do. Um, okay, I should be able to get that from the classroom. Swore you could acquire those plants from her room. Um, it's a long way.
<sighs> there they are. She wasn't making it up. Well, we've come this far. Miss Willardsy might get an answer about these butterflies. Revelio. But I did, I followed the butterflies. Oh, those are in theory. Confringo! Akio! Hogsfield. Sure. Bardo Beaumont should have returned by... Excuse me. Did you say something about Bardo? I did. I don't think... I was just worrying about Claire Beaumont. Rumour is he was seen in the forest practising dark. I fear he got himself into trouble with the... I'd help search for him myself. I can certainly look out for him. Any help would be appreciated. <laughs> you might speak to Claire... I can tell you that Bardo... Claire will be at her shop if you'd like to see. Arresto Momentum, the slowing charm. It allows you to freeze objects or people in midair. Simply complete a few tasks and then come and see me. Brown Rock's loyalists are a menace. What can be done? I couldn't help but overhead. Did I did? <sighs> nice to meet you. My brother Baldoth dared to simply at my w I'm unfortunately quite familiar with Ranrock. <sighs> Much as I would love to be. We should not have to live in fear. This is our home. Madam Beaumont. Yes? Mrs. Sprottle told me a little. Oh, dear Dorothy. She mentioned dark mad. Despite my repeated warnings, 
I thought perhaps he'd get it out of his sin. I'll let you know it. Thank you. I should be going now. Okay. Bardolph. Revelio. Where are you? I'll not give up hope. It's... It seems as though things are getting worse. Best be on my guard. How nice of you to stop by. I have a brother who works at Gringo. Pay me enough to sit behind a desk all day. One of Ranrock's camps, exactly as Madame Beaumont described. Hmm. Someone there. Wizards are running scared. <laughs> Nice of you to stop by. Oh, could do with a nice mushroom stew about now. Accio! Places! Accio! What's that? No! 
I will make you pay. I won't rest. Akio. You've one less follower, Ranrock. Revelio. Both camps cleared. Alan Beaumont will be glad to hear that. Generosity helped me afford this rather exotic snake contraption. Very Salazar, isn't it? You are most kind. I could go on for <sighs> I do miss the bustle of business. Hello, Madame Beaumont. You cleared them up. I managed to catch them off guard. When my brother returns, you saved our hamlet, my young friend. I fear for other hamlets, truly. I should be going now. <clears throat> Thank you. Sincerely. Sanbacar's tower. <clears throat> Lovely view, I'd imagine. No right, idea well, who this was. Actually, we're gonna go leave it for today. Um, just because I uh, have to get up early in the morning. So we're gonna go and leave it here. Um, I hope you enjoy. Um, see you in the next one. And, adios.